the night prayer to Saint Joseph, a daily prayer to sleep under his fatherly protection. Hello, dear friends, it's Joseph, and welcome to With Mary, the big family that helps you to pray. Please subscribe now and click on the bell to be sure to receive all of our new prayers and updates. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Saint Joseph, we place ourselves with you in the presence of the Lord in this daily night prayer. I welcome the calm, the silence, the peace, the serenity of God's presence in my heart. I can close my eyes, breathe deeply, think of my muscles which are tense, and relax them, one after another, by small movements. Again, breathing deeply, and I put myself into a posture of relaxation and peace to be available to the grace that God wants to give me in this night prayer through Saint Joseph. Thank you, Lord, for your presence. Thank you for this privileged time of prayer with you. Thank you for all those who are praying, for the whole community of those praying united with one heart in intercession to receive your peace. Amen. I invite you, dear friends, to comment on all the concerns that inhabit our hearts, the worries of this day. We lay them down now, and we entrust them to the Lord and Saint Joseph. And once they are entrusted, the Lord takes care of them. You can also leave a comment of thanksgiving for this day, for all the graces that you've received, all those that are visible or even invisible. Amen. So now let us take a few moments of silence in order to be able to do this. Lord, thank you for this day with Saint Joseph. I give you thanks for your countless gifts today. Amen. In order to bless you freely, Lord, I need to ask you for forgiveness for all my shortcomings, all my sins of this day. I want to remember them in a few moments to examine my conscience. Saint Joseph, help me to ask Jesus for forgiveness for all the evils I have committed today. From now on, I renounce all this evil. I commit myself to repair it as much as I can, and I decide to ask for God's forgiveness. Amen. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore I ask the Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Saint Joseph, you the shadow of the Eternal Father, I want to praise our Heavenly Father with you for the marvels of this day. Thank you, beloved Father, for waking me up this morning, for my morning, for my midday, for this afternoon, and for this evening or this night. Thank you, Father, for every moment that is a gift of your love, a moment when you create everything new to lead me more and more into love and grace. Thank you for having filled me during this day with your blessings and your abundant blessings in the food I have eaten, in the air I have breathed, in my relationships, in my conversations, in my activities, in my family, in my health, in my trials too, where you have accompanied me without ever abandoning me. Through Saint Joseph, Eternal Father, I thank you for all your benefits, your immense benefits. I thank you also for the blessing of prayer on this day, perhaps of the Mass that I attended, of the times of prayer that blessed me, the meetings that edified me spiritually. All this is a gift of your love, Father, to make me grow towards heaven. Be praised, be blessed, be adored and be glorified. Amen. I invite you, friends, to praise the Father in the commentary for all the gifts of this day whatever they may be, 
and I suggest that you say in the depths of your heart the beautiful prayer of Christians, of all the children of the Father which Jesus taught us. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. O glorious Saint Joseph, we now want to entrust our night to you. We ask you to watch over us personally, together with you, who receive the protection and messages of the angel in a dream. We also put ourselves in the presence of our holy guardian angel. My guardian angel, I greet you and thank you for being always near me. Thank you for your protection and your kindness towards me. I entrust to you also my night, my sleep, my dreams. Inspire me while I sleep. Watch over my rest so that it fully restores my strength. We now entrust to your prayer, Saint Joseph, all the battles of the night. You, the terror of demons, who overcame temptations by a special grace, by a special grace of God. We entrust you our thoughts of this night. Keep us from all evil thoughts, and we entrust you the purity of our hearts and bodies. Keep us from all impurity. We entrust to you the peace of our rest. Keep us from all agitation. Saint Joseph, be present with us this night, as a father with his children, as you were with Jesus and watched over his sleep. Guard our homes this night, protect our family, keep us from all fear and worry, to sleep a restful and blessed sleep. Amen. Hail Joseph, son of David, spouse of Mary. Blessed art thou amongst patriarchs, and blessed is thy holy family. Holy Joseph, guardian of Jesus, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Saint Joseph, after having entrusted my night to you, my heart soothed by your presence and filled with confidence in the Lord, I want to raise with you to heaven a powerful intercession for all my material and spiritual needs and for all those around me. I invite you, my friends, in the course of this prayer, to entrust your own needs and intentions. Amen. Saint Joseph, I entrust my family to you. Watch over everyone and lead everyone to Jesus, even those who do not yet know him. Keep everyone from all evil by your protection and change the hearts of those who do not believe in God or who do not yet follow his ways. Saint Joseph, head of the Holy Family, protect my family. Amen. Saint Joseph, I entrust to you my work, my activities of this day, in thanksgiving and my work of tomorrow, all my activities of tomorrow. Perhaps if I am unemployed, so Saint Joseph, I entrust to you my search for a job. Perhaps if I'm retired or a student or in some other situation, then Saint Joseph, I entrust to you all my past and future activities. In humble daily life, Saint Joseph the worker, I ask you to make what I do bear fruit for eternal life. Amen. Saint Joseph, I entrust to you my finances, whether they are good or difficult at this time. Be the relay to me of the providence of God who watches over all things. Keep me from all financial worries and even from all poverty, from all misery. Give me the grace to have special attention to the poor and the vulnerable. Saint Joseph, Watch over my material goods, and I entrust to you all my spiritual goods too. Amen. Saint Joseph, I entrust my health to you. It can be good or it can be bad. So Saint Joseph, keep me from all bodily, psyche, or spiritual evil. I ask you for the healing of the sick, the protection of the infirm. I entrust to you all medical staff, and I ask you for more divine charity in the medical services. Amen. Saint Joseph, I entrust the church to you, guardian of the universal church, in this evening prayer, watch over our Pope, our bishops and our priests, 
all religious and consecrated, and all lay people, married and single. Enliven each one of us and help us to know Jesus better. Help the members of the church to become saints, and we entrust to you the transmission of faith in parishes and in families. Amen. Saint Joseph, I entrust to you the protection of the world. You see how peace is threatened everywhere. Give us Jesus, Saint Joseph, for he is the Prince of Peace. Bless the world as you did at Fatima, and lead all humanity on the paths of peace and forgiveness to meet Christ. Amen. In Psalm 4, I propose to you, friends, that we put ourselves in the school of Saint Joseph and enter into the peace of the night by contemplating the face of the transfigured Christ, the risen Christ, who gives us his life. Amen. Answer me when I call, O God of my righteousness. You have given me relief when I was in distress. Be gracious to me, and hear my prayer. O men, how long shall my honour be turned into shame? How long will you love vain words and seek after lies? But now that the Lord has set apart the godly for himself, the Lord hears when I call to him. Be angry and do not sin. Ponder in your own hearts on your beds and be silent. Offer right sacrifices and put your trust in the Lord. There are many who say, Who will show us some good? Lift up the light of your face upon us, O Lord. You have put more joy in my heart than they have when their grain and wine abound. In peace I will both lie down and sleep, for you alone, O Lord, make me dwell in safety. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. And now we pray with the whole church in this evening hymn, the peaceful hymn of Simeon. Lord, now let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people. A light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Virgin Mary, in the company of Saint Joseph, your husband, we want to entrust to you right now in this decade all that tomorrow will bring, our hopes for the day and our plans. Holy Family of Nazareth, I ask that you help me feel God's tenderness at work in my sleep and for tomorrow. Keep me from all evil and protect those I love. Watch over the church and may this new day full of the Lord's promises lead everyone in blessing to the joy of heaven. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. O glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Amen. O sacred heart of Jesus, I trust in you. Immaculate heart of Mary, pray for us who have recourse to you. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Saint Michael the Archangel, pray for us. Our holy guardian angel, watch over us. All the angels and saints, pray for us. O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to you. O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to you. O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. If you enjoyed this night prayer to Saint Joseph, a daily prayer to sleep in peace under his protection, I invite you to share it with others and to come back tomorrow evening if you wish. So thank you for participating. I also want to offer you my free digital ebook, The Five Essential Keys to Effective Prayer. To download it, please click on the link that appears now or in the comments section below. And I also invite you to join the Great Novena to St. Joseph that's accessible all year round. Many thanks to you, dear friends. And may St. Joseph bless your evening, your night, your sleep, and give you sweet dreams and God's dreams to light your heart and your path of life. Amen. I look forward to praying with you again soon, but until then, God bless you and joy in Jesus.